Sticks and stones will break my bones, but words will never hurt me. You've heard that in grammar school, right? Well, it's not true. It's not true. It happened to me when I was very, very young. Words that really hurt me a lot. When I was about 14 years old, we just moved to Glendale into our new house. And I heard my parents talking to our guests at dinner. And they didn't know that I was standing in the hallway. And I heard my dad say, Frank is the black sheep of the family. Yeah. And I thought to myself, I'm the black sheep? Yes, I knew what that word meant. But I never ever thought of myself as one. Because I didn't know that I was. You see, I'm autistic. My view of the world although similar to yours, is different. I feel differently. I react differently. I think differently than most people. My mom told me that when I asked her about it many, many years later. My teachers described me as having autistic tendencies. I wasn't labeled as autistic, but I would space out a lot in the class. But of course, as a kid, I didn't know I was different until that day when I heard the word black sheep of the family. I could never shake that feeling of hatefulness because I was different. I always wished I was normal and really, really smart, but I'm not. Yes, words do hurt. They can hurt a lot. That is why today I feel so insecure about myself. I never told my mom or my dad that I heard him call me a black sheep in the hallway. I almost told my dad once when we went to a jazz concert. Dad was telling me how he felt I was holding myself back in life career-wise and he said to me that his father said to him I give you permission to be a man. So he told me, son, I give you permission to be a man and do what you want to do. And right then, I wanted to tell him about the black sheep comet that I heard in the hallway. But I didn't. I didn't want to tell him because I knew it would hurt his feelings. So I never told him. About 10 years later, he killed himself with a shotgun because he suffered from depression. So dad never knew. And to this day, mom doesn't know either that I know about the black sheep statement but it's haunted me to this day. Not that I didn't tell my dad because I knew it would hurt his feelings if he found out, but because I never thought of myself as a black sheep until then. That's a fear that'll never ever leave me. 
I hate being the black sheep. And there's nothing I can do about it. Don't be a black sheep.